What's up guys, it's Connor here. Welcome to another epic classic on the channel. Um, I know you guys are super familiar with my uh, epic uh, taste test videos. Um, I know I haven't done one since like 2017, but that's, that's besides the point. Okay, it's a very popular uh, series on the channel. Um, so I'm officially bringing it back because today we are gonna be drinking Pram um, for the motherfucker. <laughs> This is so cringy. Look, I'm, this video is totally for joking purposes. I have no intention of getting promoted by fucking Prime. I do not give two fucks. I'll get in that in a minute. But yeah, fun fact, for people who do not know, um, I actually did do taste test videos, like back in the day. Uh, mainly G Fuel, because I was big into G Fuel at the time. Um, and I thought I'd bring the series back because uh, Prime is kind of, Prime is kind of like a, because it was made by influencers and you know, you know me, I'm a full-time streamer. I stream every single day, totally, totally. I totally stream and provide content every single day. So me as an influencer, I should drink this drink that is made by influencers. So it's kind of relevant, this drink, you know, I don't, what am I saying? Okay, so yeah, we're gonna be drinking Prime. For the motherfuckers who not know what Prime is, it's pretty much the most talked about drink right now. Um, to my knowledge, I don't fucking look up the fucking statistics, um, but it is made. It's primarily popular because it was made by um, KSI Logan Paul. The, you know, the, you all know those motherfuckers, okay? The fucking the black British dude and the guy that filmed the Asian dude. So you guys know who those motherfuckers are. Um, and they released this like fucking 2021, 22. I don't fucking remember. Um, but the reason why I've not had Prime in a while because this is, this has been out for like a year or two, I think. But the reason why was because I didn't know we had this shit in Canada. Like, I don't know when the fuck they brought Prime to Canada, but literally like last week, I think I was like, last week, I think I was like, I was like walking in the mall with my friend. And then there's this like store. And then we, we go in the store and then I see Prime right fucking there. I'm like, oh my God, Prime, what the fuck? I should probably buy this and just try it out because it's been talked about all fucking year. Um, I saw that it was $6 and I'm like, uh, yeah, let me just, uh, Pull it back because six dollars i'm not buying that shit and then like a few days later i think literally the next day i went to a fucking gas station and there was prime right there for three dollars so like half off so i'm like okay i don't know what the fuck that mall was thinking making prime fucking ten dollars damn near ten dollars uh but yeah this gas station had prime for three dollars and i was like okay i'll buy this shit so i bought every single flavor that they had because you know i was like yeah let me do a fucking taste test video uh, fuck it. Um, and I'm at the gym right now because I just felt like doing it now. Um, because apparently it's a hydration drink and you know, I'm totally sweating right now. So let's get hydrated. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> prime. Okay, so I bought all the flavors at the store. I, bro, I thought there was somebody there. I was like, what the fuck? I'm literally by myself right now. Um, I don't have a fucking live audience or anything. But yeah, so I bought every single flavor that was in the gym. Okay, so the flavors that we got is Tropical Punch, which is red. And for me personally, red flavor is like always the best when it comes to like foods or drinks. Like really red flavor is always the best. Like cherry, fruit punch, like it, red's always the best flavor. So this might be the best one, who fucking knows. Uh, we have blue raspberry, which I heard is like the best flavor or like one of the best flavors. So I'm curious to try this out. Then we got lemon lime, which is not really talked about a lot. I don't really drink lemon lime. I like lemonade, I like that shit. But lemon lime, I, I, nobody talks about this fucking flavor. Um, and then we got this one, which I heard is one of the best as well, if not the best, uh, ice pop flavor, which I'm looking forward to trying this because I like ice pops. That's like my favorite fucking like, shit that suck pause. Um, I mean, no dilly dally, let's get through this. I mean, I guess I'll state it right now. Um, not gonna be biased here, okay? I, I, I am not a fucking Logan Paul dick sucker, okay? Cause I know a lot of these other fucking food reviewers or drink reviewers, they fucking drink this shit. And they're like, oh my God, they're so cool. Oh, 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 oh this tastes so good. Oh, Logan Paul, please sponsor me. It's like, no bro, I, I'll be 100% real with this shit. Um, KSI on the other hand, I'll suck his dick. So yeah, I don't know if I should shake this or not. I don't, do, I, do you shake it? I'm not gonna shake it in case it's like a fizzy drink. I don't know. So Prime, fountain drink shit. Here we go, I'm gonna open it. Jesus Christ. Okay, so it smells like fruit punch. All right, so three, two, one, go. All right, thumbnail. <laughs> Tastes like fruit punch, tastes good.
that actually tastes good. It tastes pretty good. It's not like, I mean, my prediction was that it was gonna taste like mediocre, but no, it's not bad. It tastes sugary, but it has zero, zero grams of sugar, but it tastes sugary. Apparently like it has some like artificial, whatever. I don't, I don't know about a fucking statistics guy, okay? But that is a good fruit punch drink. If you, if you like fruit punch kind of drinks, I recommend this. It, it, well, I wouldn't recommend it. There's probably cheaper drinks that probably taste better. But let's just say this was the only fucking option at the store. I recommend it. So yeah, fruit, actually not that bad. I was like, what the fuck? Um, well, I say not bad. It, it, it tastes good. It tastes good. I'll, I don't know. I'll give it an eight. Sure, fuck it. Um, like in terms of tasting good, wait, aftertaste. Okay, that was one of the aftertaste. Now we got blue raspberry. I'm not gonna shake this one, I don't fucking know. Maybe, maybe me shaking it made it taste better. I don't fucking know. Are you supposed to shake this shit? I don't know. Okay, blue raspberry, boom, boom. Um, I'm curious to try this out because I heard it's like the best one or one of the best, top three. All right. It's got a sour taste to it. It's got a teeny, teeny sour taste, you know? Like with these other, like it tastes like... I don't know how to explain it. It doesn't taste like... It doesn't, oh my God. Bro, I'm about to sue these motherfuckers. <laughs> Yo, okay, sorry, I'm gonna sue you ass. It doesn't taste like a regular blue flavor like it doesn't taste like the blue gatorade flavored or some shit no it actually has like a different taste to it it has, a, it has like a tropical taste which was kind of surprising because this is supposed to be tropical punch this tastes more fucking tropical this tastes like fruit punch this tastes like tropical shit um it has a teeny little sour tang to it and i like that yeah not bad it's like raspberry flavor but like it has a teeny bit of sour tang to it i like that all right, so far, I'm actually kind of surprised. No, I'm not looking forward to this one. Um, I mean, let's just try it anyways. Uh, lemon lime, yeah. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> Open the fucking thing. Okay. Okay. I don't like it. I don't have to explain the smell. Like, it doesn't taste, it doesn't smell bad. It just smells like lemon, which I don't really. I mean, if you like lemon lime, it tastes decent. I mean, again, I'm not a lemon lime or a lemon drink person. So like it tastes like lemon. It doesn't taste too bad. I'm just not a lemon kind of guy. So probably on the bottom of my list so far. I guess I should rank these probably. All right, next, the final one. If any other flavors come to Canada, I'm not gonna do another video of this. I don't, well maybe, I don't know, we'll see. If you guys like the video, I mean, I don't give a fuck about likes. I don't even fucking, I don't, I don't fucking post shit anymore. All right, last flavor of the day, we got ice pop, pop. No, pop your pussy. Wait, what? Uh, okay, pause. Okay, last flavor. I heard this is like the best fucking flavor. Damn. Okay. I don't really know how to explain the smell, but oh my. Dude, I'm spilling shit everywhere. Okay, three, two, one, let's go. Very, oh my God. Connor, fucking swallow before you fucking talk, pause. <clears throat> I'm surprised by the taste. So it pretty much tastes like cherry, pretty much. It pretty much has like a cherry flavor thing. And for the people who know me, you probably don't know this. If you watch my streams, like I would probably mention it one or twice, but cherry is like probably my, no, not probably. It is like my favorite flavor of anything. Like, like cherry flavored Kool-Aid, I fuck with that. Cherry flavored gummies, I fuck with that. Like it's probably like my favorite flavor of everything. Like cherry flavored freezies, I, I love that shit. It tastes like cherry. I don't taste like the white and blue, whatever the fuck these flavors would be. But I taste like the redness of the ice pop. 
Yeah, it has a cherry flavor. I like that. And these taste sugary. These taste sugary, but it has two grams of sugar, so I don't know what the fuck they put in this shit. Maybe they put fucking cocaine? I don't fucking know. We'll see. I mean, I'm not complaining. It tastes good. Okay, so... They tasted better than I fucking thought. I thought, like, everyone was fucking hyping this drink up, and then I hear other people on the sidelines saying, like, oh, it tastes mediocre. It tastes like fucking cough medicine. And I'm like, oh, shit, so this might be a diversity kind of thing. But no, it tastes fucking good. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't know if I just got some good fucking batches here, but no, it tastes good. Like, I mean, I'm not a kind of review guy, so I'm not going to get so in-depth with it, but I'm, I'll just say it tastes good. You know what I mean? It tastes fucking good. Yeah, I don't know what It tastes good. It tastes good. I mean, if I had to rate all of them overall, I'd say like an eight. I mean, if you're looking to get hydrated, I probably don't recommend this because, you know, it's like, it, like it says it has no fucking sugar, but it's like... Yeah. It's really sugary, so yeah. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, so I mean, if you're looking for like a drink and you got no other option, probably get this. Um, but yeah, it doesn't taste that bad. It, I, I mean, I'm, I'm, try, I'm undermining it, but no, it, like, it actually tastes good. Um, like, I'm not even trying to suck these fuckers off. Like, like, like I mean, don't get wrong. I mean, <laughs> I don't want to fight on misfits, but uh, I, 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 won't, I, won't, I, I won't be fake or anything. If I had to rate them, I guess... Okay, that's like that's reverse okay if i had to rate them should i should i even bring the lemon lime up here okay if i had to rate them i'd rate it in this order so ice pop is probably the best because it has like a cherry taste to it and i love that uh blue raspberry I, it tastes like tropical fruit shit but it has a little sourness to it this literally just tastes like fruit punch, which, you know, you get what you get. And then lemon lime doesn't taste bad. If you like lemon flavor, you'll probably think this is decent, but I'm not a fan of lemon lime. It doesn't even taste bad. It's just, I'm not a fan of lemon lime flavor. So yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Prime, bro. Prime. Oh my God. <laughs> Logan Paul sponsored me. Yeah. So I'm generally surprised that it tastes decent. Like, again, it doesn't taste like amazing. It's not the best drink in the world. I don't think it's worth $3 for like this little cup or thing. How much it? Yeah, I don't think it's worth, like, I think it was three fifty in Canada. I, I wouldn't buy it. That's pretty much just too expensive. But it does taste, it does taste good. It does taste good. I mean, I'm going to try the fucking, the ass pop again. Dude. That's pretty good. I like the ass pop. Um, I'll have one, I'll have final taste. Okay. I'm not trying this shit. Yeah, so this is probably like the most basic one. It's like a fruit punch. But yeah, I, I gotta do cardio, so I don't know if that's good for my stomach. I'll give you guys a post update if I get sick and die. Um, but yeah. Prime, uh... Yeah, sure. I recommend it. Sure. I mean, probably buy, probably like, I don't know, like with fruit punch, get Gatorade fruit punch. But like, I will say the blue raspberry prime has like a unique taste to it, which I would recommend trying it. Ice pop, it kind of tastes like a cherry kind of flavor. I know Gatorade had like a cherry flavored uh, drink before. I don't know if it's still there anymore, but probably get that instead. But I like the ice pop because like a cherry tang to it. But uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, prime. Tastes pretty good. Uh, do I recommend it? I guess if there's like an op, if, like like if there's not a lot of options of good drinks, like there's probably better drinks out there. But yeah, tastes not too bad. Uh, pretty good. All right, guys, I'm gonna end it here. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this awesome taste test video. Woohoo! Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, if I end up getting other flavors, maybe I'll do a taste test. I don't know. Probably not. Um, this is my first time tasting Prime. Um, oh, I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. Yeah, my first time trying Prime. It, pretty good. Pretty good. Um, I don't know if I ever buy it again, but do we know? I don't know if I ever fucking buy it again. We'll see. But uh, yeah. I'm gonna end this epic taste test video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out, guys.